Hello again, all you retro junkies. You got the retro Viking here. First of all, I want to start off today's video by apologizing because this one's going to be coming out a little bit later than usual. I had such a hectic schedule last week. It took me forever to get enough free time to be able to actually sit down and record the cam footage for this video. Everything else was done, but I just so it held up my editing schedule and all kinds of stuff. So I apologize for that. Also, you may notice that uh, the footage behind me is not going to match today's subject matter, and that's because I just didn't have time to record new stuff. So again, you'll have to work with me. Apologize for that. Without any further beating around the bush, the Atari 2600, it had a vast library of games. And while some classics like Pac-Man and Space Invaders are well known, there are many underrated gems worth exploring. Uh, these games may not have received as much attention as the Atari 2600's more famous titles, uh, but they offer unique gameplay experiences and are worth checking out for fans of retro gaming. Keep in mind that opinions on what constitutes an underrated game can vary. So, if you find different titles that resonate with you personally, then by all means. When I was compiling this list, I researched several online opinions and polls, and I was surprised that so many of the games that make this list are from Activision. Surprised because some of the most well-known and popular games on the Atari are also from Activision. The fact that they produced games that make the popular list and the underrated lists is a testament to how many good titles they made for the Atari. So with that in mind, here's a list of 10 underrated Atari 2600 games. Before we get into the rest of the video, I just wanted to take a moment to ask you a favor. If you're not already subscribed, and after looking at my analytics, most of you aren't, please take this quick second to give the video a like. Then click that subscribe button and check that bell to receive notifications for new video releases. It really helps the channel out a ton when doing battle against the YouTube algorithm. Thanks so much. We now return you to your regularly scheduled program. Number 10. All right, starting us off is Mega Mania, which was released in 1982. It's an underrated classic that delivers an intense and addictive gaming experience. In this space-themed shooter, players control a spaceship that looks suspiciously like the USS Enterprise, uh, but it must survive waves of diverse and increasingly challenging enemy formations. What sets Mega Mania apart is its inventive and imaginative enemies, ranging from hamburgers and bow ties to steam irons and diamonds, creating a whimsical and visually captivating world. The gameplay is fast-paced and demands precision, making it a true test of reflexes. Mega Mania's combination of vibrant graphics, catchy sound effects, and relentless action makes it a must-play for fans of arcade-style shooters and a standout for the 2600 library. Number 9! Next, we have Hero, or H-E-R-O, for Hella Rescue Operation. This is a hidden gem that truly stands the test of time. This innovative action-adventure game combines precise platforming and puzzle solving as players navigate treacherous underground caverns with a jetpack and a trusty helicopter-mounted laser. As Roderick Hero, your mission is to rescue trapped miners, and the game's tight controls and clever level design make each rescue attempt a thrilling challenge. Hero offers a satisfying blend of exploration and strategy, rewarding players who can master the intricacies of its mechanics with its engaging gameplay and a level of depth that belies its era. Hero remains an unappreciated classic in the Atari 2600 library, deserving recognition among retro gaming enthusiasts. Number eight. Next, we have Phoenix, and it's an arcade port that delivers addictive and challenging gameplay. 
This classic space shooter combines elements of Galaxian and Space Invaders, but brings its own unique flavor to the table. Players control a spaceship tasked with defending Earth from an alien bird-like fleet. What sets Phoenix apart are its dynamic stages, featuring both horizontal and vertical scrolling, and a challenging boss battle that adds depth to the gameplay. The graphics, while simple by modern standards, capture the essence of the arcade original and are surprisingly detailed for the Atari 2600. With its engaging gameplay and memorable boss encounters, Phoenix is a must-play for fans of arcade shooters and a testament to the Atari's capabilities. And on a personal note, this is probably the only game that I can think of where I actually prefer the Atari 2600 version to the original arcade. Number seven! All right, coming up next is Spider Fighter which is an exhilarating and often overlooked gem of the console's library. This vertically scrolling shooter combines elements of classic arcade action with a unique twist. As the player, you control a futuristic vehicle tasked with defending your base from swarms of menacing spiders. The game's fast-paced arachnid slaying action is complemented by responsive controls making it both accessible and addictive. What sets Spider Fighter apart is its ability to provide a perfect blend of challenge and fun. It's a testament to the Atari's capabilities, delivering engaging gameplay that remains captivating, even among the more celebrated titles of its era. If you're a fan of retro shooters, Spider Fighter is an underrated classic that deserves a spot in your collection. Number six! Star Master is an often overlooked gem that delivers an immersive space simulation experience. Its intuitive controls and engaging gameplay place you in the cockpit of a starship, navigating through a vast galaxy filled with celestial bodies and enemy vessels. The game's challenging missions, such as rescuing stranded astronauts and defending against enemy attacks, keep you on your toes and provide a real sense of accomplishment when completed. Despite the limitations of the Atari 2600's hardware, Star Master manages to capture the essence of interstellar exploration and combat, making it a must-play for retro gaming enthusiasts and a testament to the system's enduring appeal. Number five! Chopper Command is an adrenaline-pumping aerial shooter that deserves more recognition in the retro gaming community. While primarily a clone of the more well-known Defender, you take control of a military helicopter tasked with defending convoys from enemy attacks. The gameplay is surprisingly addictive, with responsive controls that make maneuvering your chopper joy. As waves of enemy aircraft and obstacles intensify, the challenge ramps up, keeping you engaged and on the edge of your seat. The graphics, while simplistic by today's standards, are well executed for the Atari, and the sound effects add to the immersive experience. Chopper Command offers classic arcade-style action and an impressive sense of accomplishment when you successfully complete each level, making it a hidden treasure in the Atari 2600 library that's worth rediscovering. Ooh yeah, number four, dig it! Sequest is a game that often goes overlooked. The underwater adventure game delivers surprisingly addictive gameplay as you pilot a submarine rescuing divers and avoiding enemy threats. The graphics, while simple, effectively capture the feeling of deep sea exploration, and the gameplay mechanics are easy to pick up but challenging to master. With its catchy jingle and increasingly frantic action, Sequest offers an engaging and rewarding experience that keeps players coming back for more. If you're looking for an underrated classic in the Atari library, Sequest should be at the top of your list. Yo, yo, Gorsh, number three. Barnstorming is yet another underrated classic that delivers simple yet addictive gameplay. In this charming game, you take on the role of a daring barnstormer pilot 
navigating your biplane through a series of increasingly challenging barns and obstacles. The objective is straightforward. Fly through the barns as quickly as possible without crashing. While the premise may seem basic, the game's tight controls and clever level design and gradual difficulty curve make it a surprisingly engaging experience. The thrill of narrowly avoiding collisions while striving for high scores keeps players coming back for more. With its accessible mechanics and timeless appeal, Barnstorming remains a hidden gem in the Atari library, offering a delightful trip down memory lane for retro gaming enthusiasts. Yeah, number two, He-Man. River Raid 2 is an often overlooked game that successfully builds upon the foundation of its predecessor. With its improved graphics and more intricate level design, it delivers a more immersive and challenging experience. Piloting your sleek fighter jet through narrow canyons and navigating treacherous waters while taking out enemy tanks and helicopters remains as addictive as ever. The addition of fuel management adds an extra layer of strategy, making each move more crucial. While it may not have achieved the same iconic status as the original, River Raid 2 is a worthy sequel that offers retro gaming enthusiasts an exhilarating journey down memory lane. Number one! And finally, here we are. Cosmic Arc was an interstellar adventure that often goes unnoticed but shouldn't be underestimated. With its captivating blend of space shooting and resource management, it's a hidden gem in the Atari library. Players must protect a mothership from relentless meteor attacks while also embarking on daring missions to rescue creatures from hostile planets. The game's graphics, considering the hardware limitations of the time, are surprisingly detailed and visually engaging, immersing you in the vastness of outer space. Cosmic Arc's gameplay is both challenging and addictive, requiring strategic thinking and precise shooting skills. This underrated classic deserves a spot in any retro gaming library, offering a delightful mix of spacefaring action and rescue missions that remain entertaining to this day. Well, there you have 10 underrated Atari 2600 games. I'm sure you may have some favorites, but this was actually a hard list to compile because most of the games that people are aware of with Atari they're fiercely loyal to, and there's so many really, really popular games. So I felt I would be doing a disservice to fellow retro gamers without throwing out a few that they may not be aware of. Here's the pickle that we have coming up for our next video, guys. Uh, where should we take it? You know, what, what type of uh, list would you like to see me work on? Or what, you know, any particular, maybe you have um, a particular game that you don't think gets enough attention that you would like to see me you know not only play but do a review of something either you know from the atari or the nintendo or the sega master system or the genesis the super nintendo you know any one of those older systems from like the 80s or 90s if maybe there's something you think needs more attention and you'd like to see me give it a try let me know. I'll consider it for a future video. Mention it down below in the comments. Um, so other than that, throw me a like and subscribe if you could be so inclined. And until next time, take care of yourselves and have a great week.